New since six, we're getting more details about the death of a five-year-old boy in Camden County. His mother's now charged with murder. Investigators say she abused him. 25-year-old Maria Alas was charged today, and investigators say that her son died Monday. Alas' boyfriend, 23-year-old Max Meza, was charged with making false statements. Investigators say Alas is from El Salvador, but lives in Kingsland. News from Jackson Porter Corley Field joining us live in the Camden Point neighborhood where Alas lives. And Corley, it sounds like the neighbors knew the boy died, but they didn't know about the alleged abuse. That's right. Several neighbors tell me when they saw police in this neighborhood on Monday, they thought it was because the boy had drowned. They say they were shocked when they found out several days later that he actually died from his mother abusing him. Maria Alice is now charged with murder after deputies say she abused her five year old son, killing him. Her boyfriend, Max Meza, is also charged for making false statements, according to detectives. Liz Guerrero lives across the street from Alice. I've never heard anything of yelling, violence, or what. Mm -hmm. Never did. I think it's disgusting and inhumane, and any mother of a child who loves their child could not do that to their child. On Monday, deputies say Alice and Meza flagged down a deputy near South Grove Boulevard and communicated through broken English that the boy in her lap was unconscious. The boy died at the hospital, and later in the week, it was determined he died from child abuse. Neighbors tell News for Jacks they heard a different story on Monday. They heard the boy drowned. Originally, it was a five-year-old had drowned in a pool, and then I get on Facebook and there's a link, and it's a child died of abuse from their own parents, and it's tragic and it's sad. GBI sent News for Jacks this crime scene investigation document stating they responded to a child's death where a child reportedly drowned. The address listed on the document is the same address where neighbors say Alice lives. I really hope that she gets what she deserves and that she feels as much pain or more than she put her child through. The Camden County Sheriff's Office is leading this investigation. I have reached out to them to find out if and why the boy's child's death was reported as a drowning at first, but I have not heard it back yet. Reporting live from Camden County, Corley Peel, Channel 4, The Local Station.